All right, friends, subscribers, and internet strangers, what's up? BP here in the side of a just got off a garage. <laughs> All right, so today I got a short video for you, just a, a lesson to keep your head on a swivel. never know where inventory is coming from so here I am right I'm just moseying along with it I've got the laptop over here because everything over there is a mess and it was just easier to set up the mobile office when an, an alert came on Facebook so I clicked over to the tab and lo and behold somebody posted these for free in the Facebook group look at those chairs pretty cool right so I noticed the tab, I looked at it, and I replied, hey, I'll take those. So what, because what can BP do with those? <laughs> hey, Harlan goes to an auction, right? Guess who's taking my chairs to auction? Let's go see what we got. Ooh, that was terrible, wasn't it? All right, so it helps to have a van. Oh, am I glad to have the red one back. That Dodge is all right, but it ain't no Toyota. So this is what we ended up with. That guy there, it's a swivel. And then a desk chair. So you just never know where you're gonna find inventory. And this is the one, the greatest cost. I love me some free. Free, free, free is very good, good, good. So what's the moral of the story? What, what does BP want you to know today? Make sure that if you live in a neighborhood that you're in your Facebook groups. Um, let every, let people know in your neighborhood what you do. That you that you sell stuff, you get rid of stuff. You know, that's that's the way I would pose it. Not even as much sell stuff as if, if you need something gone, I'll come get it and get rid of it. Um, and then you make the decision whether you can resell it. Especially if you've got a local auction like Harlan does. You can throw this stuff on Facebook Marketplace and these things will be gone pretty quick. You know, with extra $20, $25 maybe. Uh, I will let you know what they go for at the auction, but you know, take advantage of local. Everybody, when they talk about taking advantage of local, local sourcing, you know, it's it's a website, it's a this. Sometimes it's just Facebook, Facebook groups for your neighborhood, and people give away stuff free. There, maybe once a week something's given away free in ours, and I just happened to to be here this week and saw the notification and went, hey, I'll take those. Where did I get the last time? I got something else the last time. I, this is the third time I picked something up in the neighborhood that wasn't out on the street. I've picked a few things up off the street too as well. So be aware of your local groups and take advantage of every opportunity because your cost and what you can sell something for when it's free is uh, it's hard to beat. Do the YouTube stuff. I appreciate you. I uh, will beg you to like, comment, subscribe. Sub sub subscribe if you haven't. And uh, I got to come up with a better saying than Donna. I'll work on that. All right. Have a good day. Thanks for watching. <laughs> oh, yeah. Roll Tide. P.S. <laughs> there is a chance that these chairs will not be sold. If the queen sees them and decides she likes them, I won't be able to sell them. <laughs> so, uh... If I can sneak them by Joni, I'll sell them, and because I got, I think she might want the the look. It'll be a good makeup chair. I can, I can see her inventing a use for those chairs. So we're gonna have to hide them from Joni. So hopefully I'll have gotten rid of them before she watches this video. If not, they will probably be keepers. I didn't even think about that. Ah. All right, <laughs> roll tie. All right, PSS. I was walking by the door and I saw the. It's not pretty. But I traded my brother a $20 pair of shoes that I bought that I bought it for him anyway. And he's like, how about I just give you that and we'll call it even. So you can pick up things even from relatives, even other resellers to use in your business. I didn't have a pallet jack. Look up how much pallet jacks cost. Uh, yeah, three to four to five hundred dollars for pallet jacks. That's the cheap ones. So 20 bucks. 
yeah be creative be creative every dollar you save is a dollar you made roll tight again you got three roll ties this is one heck of a video